All right, hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video here on the channel. I feel really stupid. I did just sit down and spend like an hour and a half finding all these wall bank spots on meat just to find out my microphone was muted the entire time. Yeah, so we're going to do a little bit of a speed run of the video because honestly, this map has a lot of cheese in it. When I say a lot of cheese, I mean you can kill people as soon as they spawn with these wall bangs I'm about to show you. So I'm going to break them up in sections, of course. So when this timer counts down, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the map and what areas we're going to focus on first. So as you can see, here's the areas on the map. What we're going to focus on is this side spawn, mid, and then this side spawn, right? And of course, some of these wall bank spots are able to be used both ways, of course, while others are only one sided from what I've learned on this map so far is if you were to cut this map in half right here, this map is honestly one-sided, right? There's more wall bank spots on this side of the map compared to this one right here, right? So if you're ever playing this map and you get killed a bunch of times through this side of the map compared to this one, just know means he doesn't suck. It's just the way this map has been laid out. There's a lot of cheese in it. So first and foremost, we're gonna focus on this spawn right here, right? So a quick brief breakdown. Spawns are back here, but they didn't nerf this spawn and move these spawns into this crate. This crate is in fact bulletproof. You cannot chew through it, no matter how hard you try. Unless you have actual cheats, but let's all face it. If you're cheating like that on the game, you got a big forehead like me. All right, so the spawns are back here in this back room, right over here and right here, right? So from what I learned, is you can use these doors as a wall penetration spot. Some of the doors on this map are in fact bulletproof, just so you know, right? These doors are bulletproof compared to this door right here, which most likely probably isn't, but it is. So the blue doors are bulletproof. These doors that are on this other side of the map, just showing you it real fast. These are not bulletproof, but I don't think it'll count as a wall penetration kill. The reason why is there's no particles when you shoot through it. Just something you know, right? So like I said, we're gonna focus on this side of the map. Um, You can shoot through this right here. You could stand in this corner, line yourself up, right? And if you need to, which I would recommend, you mark there to where you know where you're gonna be aiming. But of course, you're looking at your mini map. One piece of advice I can give for lining yourself up on your mini map is using a toothpick, a piece of string, and some scotch tape. You just put on your monitor, of course. Um, try not to use no duct tape because you'd probably screw your monitor up, but scotch tape honestly would be fine. It's not going to hurt anything. It's very weak tape. The adhesive on it ain't really going to do anything crazy unless you like put some super glue on it. Then that's your own problem, right? So you can find, you could press pause or something or pull up this mini map right here. Well, I don't think it'll work right there, but for your top left corner, just to line yourself up perfectly to where wherever you aim on the map on your mini map it's going to be lined up and you'll be able to snap on people with your mini map honestly i did this in vanguard and i got called a cheater a lot of times for it but honestly once you do it a lot you don't really need to use that thing you were training with because there's times when i'm playing a game and i got a uev or advanced uev up i'm just staring at my mini map i know that i'm centered in my screen and i'm just staring at my mini map and just lining up and just shooting people. Like right now I'm staring at my mini map. I know I'm centered with this right here. And you just shoot through and you can see I'm getting hit markers. It's that easy, right? So you can shoot through that. Um, you can shoot through this wall right here. This right here is bulletproof. You cannot shoot through this sign for the life of yourself. You cannot do it. You can go up here. You can climb on top of this vehicle right here. And you could shoot through this right here. And you can get wall penetration kills in the hallway i don't know why it says okay never mind you could shoot through this hallway right here to get a guide on it of course if you want to go for them penetration kills is you can just mark that right there of course should be able to shoot through that right um when it comes to the spawn point right here um you can place a deployable cover right here use a piece of equipment jump up align yourself up with the center of this brick right here and you'd be able to shoot them in their spawn right here all like that you can shoot through this wall right here but just know this wall is basically one-sided i'm going to explain so place that right there we won't be able to hit it right but because there's bulletproof glass right here you can stand on the semi and you could shoot through that right you could shoot through this wall right here 
awkward spawns down here and you know people behind this wall and vice versa you can shoot through this wall to hit people all the way down there right all right so now since that's done we're going to go into mid map now mid map actually has a lot of places to offer and honestly you probably don't even gotta leave mid map when it comes to probably getting your very first mgb in this game let me explain right first off coming from this side spawn you don't even gotta run in the mid map you can post up here you can aim right of course you want to be centered so one thing you can use to center is the bottom of the sticky note right here shoot left side to line yourself up right because you need to be center mass for you know shooting right you can aim down right here you can use this bottom triangle piece right here of this drawn race board and you can shoot left side you can hit them when they come around that head glitch and if you turn right you can shoot them right side let me show you just so that you know to run that talking here. just to say things that's right side and right here Over is going to be left side right pretty busted in my opinion right left side right here Hit them on both sides. Don't even gotta run in the mid-map, stupid, right? Then, um, let's say they're spawning on the other side of this door over here, which there is a spawn point right here. They're spawning back here. You can shoot them when they come around this corner from mid-map, which is insane, right? Just like that, right? You can do it crouched, and I think you can do it prone. Yeah, you can. So you got that right there, right? Oh, this ain't even just it. See this door right here? You can shoot through this door, right? I don't think you can shoot this way because the meat right here is in the way and i think the meat is bulletproof which makes sense but you can shoot through this door going this way dude so look there's a spawn point right here in this back room right as you can see you see the door right there you place the deployable cover down so i can prove it to you guys you're gonna run right here level yourself up with these buttons right here like in the center of it hey look at that look at that dude you can do it prone too. So you can hit that spawn point, right? So you just can't hit this spawn point. You can hit that spawn point as well. But trust me, it gets crazier, right? You go over here left side. Remember that bulletproof crate I was talking to you about? You can shoot people to it from mid-map without even showing your ugly face. Post up right here, right? You go right here. You can shoot through this right here. Yep, you see, I shot right there. I'm running low on ammo, so I might have to reset. You shoot through this wall right here right shoot through this whole wall right here once you get to these barrels you can't really shoot through it no more let me reset my ammo because there's a lot more cheese to show you all right so as i just shown you right you're able to shoot through this whole wall right here dude and hit them right here in this corner without even showing your face right we still haven't left mid map guys we can still shoot people right so let's say you're still on mid map right you can post up right here you can place a deployable cover i don't think you can stand up here because you do have that barricade above you which makes sense but you can shoot through this wall aiming through this doorway right here right and you can hit them in this back spawn right here remember you're still in mid map you haven't shown your forehead bro right have not shown your forehead right wall banging people right off a of spawn insane right this wall you cannot shoot through this wall which makes no sense because this side of the map's one-sided when it comes to shooting through stuff. This side, not so much. This this wall's bulletproof. So you're still in mid-map, right? Doing your thing. Guess what? Guess just guess what? Just just guess what? Go down in the comments right now and just guess what right now. Guess guess what you can shoot through. Just guess. Guess guess what you can shoot through. Guess what you can shoot through. This is crazy. So you can post up right here at this garage. Aim right here. Of course, that'll be like the spawn point down there. You can shoot through this whole garage door right here. No problem. And if you need to, you can place a deployable cover, stand on top of it, and shoot through it some more. But also, you'll be able to get a little bit of an angle on them on the right side, because you kind of have this pallet in your way. So you'll be able to shoot a little bit above the pallet. That's totally fine. But you can shoot them through that. Absolutely bonkers, right? But you're still in mid-map. So right here, you're still in mid-map. I got it placed all the way back in their spawn right there. You're on this head glitch right here. You can hit them back there. I broke the deployable cover already, as you've probably just seen, but you can hit them, right? You can hit them back spawn right there. You're not even leaving mid-map. You got control of that side of the map, this side of the map. You can hit them right there. You can hit them right here. You can hit them right here. And you can hit them right here on the opposite side of this. So you're not even leaving. You're not even leaving mid-map. It's so cheesy, bro. Literally, if you are in a party... Reverse boosting, VPNing, however which way you enjoy the game, you don't have to leave mid-map. You can cheese the whole map. Think about that. You could shoot people through this wall when they're coming through this way if you miss them right here, right? They're coming over this way. You can't shoot through this wall. You can shoot right here, right? Back of their spawn. 
If you need to, you could probably place a deployable cover right here where it's not so close. And you can wall bang them through this whole wall right here, right? See them coming back crate? Shoot them through back crate. See them coming back this spawn? Shoot them through that wall, right? Shoot them through this wall. You need to place a deployable cover, stand up. You could shoot them through this whole wall. And I think you could get a cheesy angle back there. But because this is bulletproof, I don't think you can do that, which is fine. We've done witnessed enough cheese in mid map. We don't we don't really need any more. So that's just mid map for you, right? Let's go. Let me go ahead and show you the other side, right? We're going to focus on this side of the map, right? Going on this side of the map, um, something that you need to know is if you've got walls that are like this that are back to back, you cannot penetrate through both of them. Some walls in the game you can, but a majority of the time you can't. So you see, I'm I'm shooting through this wall. I can't hit it. If I get to one wall, you can't. That's something to keep in mind, of course. So you can shoot through this whole back wall right here, right? You can shoot through this whole back wall going into that side of the spawn right here. You can go prone and we're gonna be shooting through this little doorway right here. And you can shoot through this whole thing right here, right? And get them on the back of the area right there. Um, You can shoot through a lot of this barrier right here. Do you wanna prove it to you real fast? Right, so you can shoot through this, this, this um going toward the back spawns right there you place a deployable cover just to get a little higher mark it to where you know where to aim at the bottom of the triangle and you can level out this whole bottom part right here just know that this crate will be in your way so there's that you can shoot through that shoot through that um this tin building right here honestly it's insane you can stand all the way right here right shoot through this tin building hit them right here when they come out of the crate, either on this side or coming out of this side, you can hit them right here. You can shoot through this whole wall. And I'm going to shoot from that direction all the way back there to where you guys can see it, right? I don't want to say things and not be able to prove it to you guys. So we're just going to ping right there in that corner, right? Of course, you can shoot through that pallet and that small opening into that spawn point right there. But the other way around, it's better because you do got a better angle from this side of the map compared to that side of the map. But you can shoot through this wall. You can shoot through this wall as well. Since this is tin, you can shoot through this spawn point right here, all the way over here, especially over that head glitch. You can actually shoot through two walls. Like I showed you earlier, you can't. On this side, you can, which is really weird. So we're gonna be shooting through that barricade, stone wall, and right here, and you can hit them both, probably because that's stone and that's tin and you know the two are different materials i guess um but yeah you can shoot through that right so nobody's safe but if you place a deployable cover like right here stand on it you now are leveled right you're leveled with the spawns up there and you're able to hit the spawns down here as well too just know this right here will be in your way now like i did state that's basically all the wall bank spots for this map um i did in fact record a whole video for it um, but real quick, there's this wall bang on this wall as well. Um, you can line yourself up with this rust spot right here and basically go back and forth like this. And you should be able to hit the spawns right here. There's one there, one there, and I think there's one right here. You could lay down right here. You can hit this back room right here, right? Let me show you real fast just to prove it to you. So you're going to be laying down. You'll be able to hit them when they come around this corner right here. Only got seven bullets left until I got to reset. But you don't got to really lay down. You can crouch. You know what I mean? But laying down gives you that extra bit of angle to where you can hit them through there. So that's basically all the wall bank spots for this map, man. And honestly... I'm surprised on how cheesy you could play mid map. Like, honestly, when I play with the party, I'm going to try to get a wall penetration kill only MGB. And honestly, on this map, it is possible. Just know, and it's really unfortunate, if you are a Steam player or a Battle.net player, if you're going to be killing people like this on PC, unfortunately, if you get reported for it, you might get shadow banned. It's unfortunate on how the system works, but it is just the way it is, you know? Um, it sucks that the anti-cheat actually doesn't work how it's supposed to. Um, when I was shadow banned, for the stupid reason I was because I was spam reported, I was playing against people in shadow banned lobbies that did not know what was going on. Like, these people were below my skill bracket by, like, a ton. I mean, I had people walking around crouch walking, you know what I mean, laying down, crawling, like bots, bro, in my shadow ban lobby. But what I did realize, one in every 12 or one in out of every 24 players based off the lobbies that I played 
were actually hackers, right? So instead of banning the hacker, they put them in shadow ban lobbies with people that were accused of cheating, even though they weren't cheating, such as myself. And it just ruined the experience for everybody. But I don't want to go on that tangent, of course, kind of went a little bit of a tangent there. I really hope you enjoyed today's video, man. It was, this is insane, honestly. Out of all, like I said, out of all the maps we've had in Call of Duty, this map is very awesome. Like, look at it, traditional three lane map. You got this lane right here, this lane right here, and this lane right here, right? This map layout is perfect. One of the best maps I've played in a long time. Flow of it is, an, is fast. It's extremely fast paced. And you could just cheese. You could just cheese the hell out of min map. Honestly, like, it's insane. But um, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And... If you're new here, consider subscribing. It's completely free and you can always change your mind later. Here on the channel, we are on the path to 1,000 subscribers. The support has been insane over the past month. We've gained close to almost 100. So let's see if we could, you know, get another 100 before January. You know what I mean? Who knows? Um, but further ado, I want to thank you for stopping by. It does mean a lot. And I hope I can see you in the next one. My name is Sweaty, and I want to thank you for watching today's content. I'll catch you guys later. Since Sweaty, have a nice day. No sweaty mop on the grind, never stopping. Clean up the game, flow straight popping. Wiping up the mess, ain't no need to stress. Sweating for success, always at your best. Sweaty mop, you're the one who's making moves. Leaving beats so fresh, setting up the grooves. From the bottom to the top, you climb non stop, determined and focused. Your energy can't flop. You soak up challenges like a mop in a spill. Turn the obstacles into thrills, showcasing skills. Your rhythms and rhymes, they always intertwine. Like cleaning up a mess, you make the flow shine. Your verses hit hard like a mop on the floor. Dropping wisdom and truth, leaving heads explore sweaty mop you're unique your style's refined your rap game strong leaving others behind so here's you sweaty mop in the rap scene your hustle and grind forever supreme your mop the game clean no need to stop your legacy carved deep yeah that's sweaty mop hit that sub button fool